State. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of mostly sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. We've got a bit of a mixed bag out there. The mix is really coming from the semis, which were up 15 bucks. That's about a half a percent. Otherwise, the other U.S. indices trading to the downside. Dow's off 133, S&P 5. NASDAQ is off about uh, 1. Russell's down 8. Uh, as I said, the semis are up 15. Gold's up about 15. Silver's up 25 cents. Lights we crude up a nickel. Natural gas up two cents. And the 30 year treasury printing out at 130.07. That's up about half a point. Let's go take a look at what all this means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini. The ES Mini is attempting to form a new profile out here. Now, what we do know is the ES Mini has a sell the D point pattern. That sell the D point pattern would only be negated with a close above 41.7775. We're trading right now at 41.73. Watch the end of day close out here. That new profile has resistance at 41.88. If this does take hold, know that the pro that the level of support now is changed for the ES Mini, and that level would be down at about the 41.06 area. Spot volatilities is below the low of yesterday. That is a bullish signal for the S&P 500. The NQ still needs a bearish reversal candle to confirm a Rhodes momentum indicator top. But we've just been trading in this sideways range out here, price above the top of its profile. That is a bullish signal. The U.S. dollar index did find resistance at the top of its profile. That was up at the 101.38 level. Now it's backing off. We've just got a we have a buy the D point pattern with price consolidating with inside its profile. It's a fairly narrow range. Support is at 100.96. Goldilocks consolidating with inside its daily profile out there. That's between the range of 1974 to 2040. Silver does not have a top. What silver did was it made the 1.272 expansion of its last set of swing points. That price projection was 26.29. Price didn't get all the way up there. It only got up to 26. 26, no, 2624 is what it got up to versus 2629. And then it's backed off just a bit. Uh, price is still above the top of its daily profile, so it is in bullish formation. Lights we crude finding resistance at the 8337 uh, level. That's the top of its weekly profile. Right now, just trading with inside its daily profile. Resistance there at 8181, support 7802. Natural gas has got some potential. It did close above the center of its bullish structure daily profile yesterday. That will typically lead to a push up to the top of the profile. Expect natural gas to get up to 262. 30-year Treasury did, in fact, find support at the bottom of its daily profile yesterday. That's at 129.22. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show. If you're off to start your Tuesday, please have a terrific one. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.